In this video, I'll show you how to configure an automatic break-even strategy. You'll learn how to access the Stop Strategy menu and configure the auto break-even properties, including Profit Trigger and the Plus field. I'll also show you how to disable or enable auto break-even on the fly. The auto break-even feature helps to limit losses as price action moves in your favor. To create an ATM strategy with an auto break-even feature, I'll select Custom from the ATM Strategy drop-down menu. I'll enter Stop Loss and Profit Target values, then select Custom from the Stop Strategy menu. Here I can define a profit trigger. This is the number of ticks in profit before the auto break even is triggered. There's also a plus field, which accepts positive or negative numbers representing ticks away from your entry price. A value of 1 will move your stop loss one tick ahead of your entry price, and a value of negative 1 will move it one tick behind. I'll click OK and save my ATM strategy template, then enter a name for my strategy. Now let's watch this ATM strategy in action. First, I'll make sure my save strategy is selected from the drop down menu and that I have the appropriate quantity selected. I'll click Buy to enter the market long. Order filled. As the market hits the profit trigger I defined, notice my stop loss order moves to one tick ahead of my entry, allowing me to break even on this trade. If my stop is filled, the corresponding profit target is automatically cancelled. Stop filled. Auto break even can also be disabled or re enabled on the fly on working stop loss orders. To disable the auto break even feature, I'll right click on the stop loss order, then hover over the order description. I'll select Auto Break Even and uncheck Enabled. To re enable Auto Break Even, I'll follow the same steps but recheck Enabled. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out more of our videos for quick tips to help you get started with NinjaTrader.